right, it's Saturday morning. Val's still not feeling so well, so I told her to go ahead and stay in bed today. Uh, I get to do some work around the house. There's a bunch of stuff that I want to do, that I need to do. Uh, I will deal with these dishes today. Uh, do laundry, which we didn't get done last week. Uh, and uh, I still have to put all of the Halloween stuff up in the attic space. So I'll be doing that myself today. And if there's time left, I can go into the garage and get some work done in the garage. Okay, so I decided to open up today. It's not too bad. Uh, I know it probably sounds awful for those of you who are around the country. Sub-zero temperatures. And I know there's some of you from other countries that are probably freezing out here. It's around 61 degrees out here right now. We still have a, a growing lawn. It's a little overcast, and that's about as worse as it is. I'm just wearing t-shirt and jeans. Sorry. Of course, uh, you have water. We don't. All right. So, I'm not trying to upset Mama Kitty, who is hiding in here. But this is all Halloween stuff that needs to be put into the attic space. And I have been looking for my knee pads because I need, it's really bad in there and I really need knee pads. But of course, I cannot find anything in my garage. So instead of spending a whole day looking for knee pads, I'm just going to bite the bullet and put this stuff away, rack up my knees. It's a small space. My biggest concern is keeping um, Mojo out of here because he seems to love it back here. So believe it or not, I'm doing laundry. Val's not doing well. Uh, she's actually more sore today than she was yesterday, which is kind of how things work out when you hurt yourself. It's kind of like whiplash where it, it really doesn't start hurting until later. So I'm doing laundry. I'm sure I'll hear about it. Mostly need my work clothes, but I'll do as much of it as possible. Uh, I'm going to avoid drying any of their shirts and dresses because that's where they usually yell at me. Uh, towels and uh, blankets usually, towel, yeah, and uh, carpets are usually an issue as well. And uh, even when they wash it, it's a mess, but at least they don't yell at me when they make mistakes. <laughs> that's how it works out. This mountain of clothes, it's about two weeks worth. Uh, it's a good thing I have about two weeks worth of uh, business clothes that I can actually wear. Otherwise, I'd be naked at work. Alright, so Val's still asleep. I'm getting things stuff done. It's always the best time to get stuff done is when Val's asleep. But it's lunchtime and we need to get some stuff at the store. And so I'm going to go do that and I'm going to use my uh, stand in my car. I don't get to use it very often. So, um, basically, I'm going to go to uh, the grocery store. I need to get some uh, soap dishes. I got a wash in the washing machine. Um, and uh, I'm going to go to Alberto's and get a carnitas burrito for Val because she really likes those. Uh, it's, it's kind of a sticky day. It's a little warmer than you think it should be. It's probably in the 70s now. It was supposed to rain yesterday, but it didn't. But it got kind of damp, so now it's just a little humid. And I have to uh, turn the air conditioner on. How do you like that? Now this is a crazy intersection, and I can't believe what the traffic is like today. This, is, this has like three lights in a row, about 10 feet away from each other. Not timed, of course, so you sit and wait forever to get through this. The only thing you can think of is that people are Christmas shopping already. Because it's never like this, except during the holidays. So guys, it's going on 1 o'clock. I just woke up. I'm still not feeling that great. But I have no idea where Kevin is. Um, I, I know he was going to go do some shopping. So, he might be out doing that right now. But, I'm not sure. Let me go check the house. He also said he was going to do some cleaning up, so... 
I don't know if he did. Here it is. Uh, Boomer. And the floor's still messy. There's Mr. Flackles. And the Flackles. Uh, there's Bootsy. It doesn't look like he did too much in the house, but he was also going to do laundry and work in the garage today. Freckles is barking right now, so maybe Freckles, maybe he's home now. Let me go check. What are you barking at, Freckles? Huh? What are you barking at? Is Daddy home? Yep, it looks like Daddy's home. It looks like Daddy's home. So I found Kevin. He was grocery shopping. And he got us all kinds of goodies. He got us vanilla cupcakes with frosting and sprinkles on them. They sound yummy, yummy. I'm going to have me one of those later. And what else did we get? A soda can on the floor. We got, what is, oh! I got those, Justin. They look like it's something you could throw some a sandwich together. Yeah! It's bread, it's not a tortilla. Yeah, and, uh, I like that. So. I can't get to my bread box to put it away, so I'm going to put it over here for right now. It looks like it would probably last longer than a loaf of bread, because bread doesn't last long around here. Eggs. Eggs. Lunch meat. <laughs> I'm sorry. He got me my Milano's and he got me my tea and I'd like to get a cup of that because the other tea is upset in my belly, I think. Okay. So I knew I needed to get something and I figured I might as well get some lunch too. Yay, sounds yep. yummy. I don't know if you guys can see that or not, but I just got a text from Megan, and she has been accepted into UC Davis for the fall 2015 semester. Cool. I'm happy, but I'm sad. I'm happy because I know she needs to get moving on to her career, and she really wants to get moving on to her career, but I'm sad because it's like nine hours away, mm -hmm. and I'm going to miss her. Yo, Boomer, you don't make muffins on Daryl. That's my Daryl. You don't make muffins on my Daryl. Put his eyes out. Don't you listen to daddy. Don't you listen, don't you listen to him. Sharpen your nails on his face. Sharpen your nails. Sharpen your nails. Stick your tongue out at him. <laughs> you don't make muffins on my Daryl. <laughs> Stop instigating. Hey, he's my cat. Yeah, you knocked Daryl down earlier oh, today, know, too. I heard. Good job. Well, my work clothes are finally done. I still got another wash in the dryer. I actually got a lot done in the garage, although you you could not tell. I had to put the, just putting more and more stuff up under the walls where they belong and hanging them from the ceiling next to that thing. <laughs> so it's getting there. As you can see, it's going quite slowly and it's going to take a while. Okay. I come out here and I want to make some ribs and some potatoes and the kitchen's a freaking disaster. It's not bad at all. You told me you were going to clean up. There's no trash bags in there so like there's trash on the counter. There's empty soda cans. This doesn't belong in here. Oh, you know, I don't know what I'm going to 
do if once I have my surgery. If you guys can't help keep my house cleaned up, then I'm not going to be able to have my surgery. <laughs> Don't laugh. It's not funny. I gotta have my surgeries, and I can't have them if my house is a mess. This is not a mess. This is a mess. None of these. Look at all these dishes. Okay, crisis diverted. Kevin helped me cut up the potatoes, and we got the potatoes on the stove, and the ribs in the oven, and I cleaned up some of the dishes. I can't do those bottles though because the bottle cleaner is hard to get into those bottles. And I just don't have the strength right now. So, we got the ribs in the oven. Yummy, yummy, yummy. They're going to be done before my potatoes are done, though. So, and I'm just frying some potatoes up in some olive oil. So, Kevin's in there looking for a movie for us. Hi, baby. Working hard. Yeah, I am. Oh, I think you're... <laughs> Everybody, guess what time it is? Beep. I don't know what time is it. <laughs> time to poke Kevin in the nose. Time for a <laughs> shout out. <laughs> <laughs> time for shout outs. Janet Johnson asked us if we can add her fur babies to the credit roll. Prissy Boo Pris and Houdini. Houdini. Does Houdini get out a lot? He's an escape artist, you know. Oh. Unedited Life 01. I know I've given her a couple of shout outs, but she wants to get to 100 subscribers, and she's only at 18. And she travels all around the place right now until she gets back into college. So give her a check out. Uh, give her a check out. <laughs> give, give her a check out. out. Give her a check out. <laughs> Go to her channel, check her out, give her a thumbs up, and subscribe. Chow. Andromeda Seafeld. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I got it right. <laughs> She's one of Dana Besaw's best friends, who's been a very long standing faithful subscriber to the neighbors for a long time now. That's right. Um, She's, she's uh, Team Kevin. Is she? She's Team Kevin. No, because you always said her name team, wrong. Team Kevin. Ask her. She's always been Team Kevin. She's got a polar bear hat now. I bet you she's Team Valerie. Team Kevin. Anyway, she just started her own channel. She's only got one vlog up so far, but go check it out. Subscribe to her channel. Give her a thumbs up, and let's get her channel built up for her. Therese, welcome back. I missed you so much. He's probably been there. He's probably been watching. Yeah, but he hasn't made any comments, so I missed him. Uh -huh. I'm allowed to miss him. He he's our he's our uh, channel uh, bodyguard or security. security guard, security, whatever you want to call him. But he he's he takes care of our channel. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So welcome back, Therese. I'm uh, Therese. 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 I said it right. Welcome back. And you, sir. Jeepers. Angie Lupus Life. Justina C. Tom Show. Annie Creasy. And Terry Johnson, as long as I no longer hit you with my shout out book. All say you should sing me soft, kitty. Why? Because I'm injured and ill. Do I, should I sing it continuously until, until you're better? Yeah, <laughs> I do. I think you should. Well, maybe I should actually l learn the words to it then. We have the DVD right up there. Just pop it in. Maybe. 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 Well, until he says yes, Terry, that's what he gets. Anyway, it's time. Then you'd have to kids. You have to sing me soft, Kitty. Why? Because you keep hurting me. This doesn't hurt. You cannot tell me that hurts. Sure, I can. But you'd be lying. <laughs> <laughs> boomer, come here, boomer. Hi, Boomster. Boomer. The Boomer came for his guest appearance. Come on, Boomer. Oh well, keep going. 
going. Okay. Here come up a little bit. It is time for the neighborhood community credit rolls. And you know what we're going to show you? What? I think we should show them the demolition of our kitchen. <laughs> the one we have before this one. We didn't just tear <laughs> apart. This is the remodel that's not done yet. But you should see the old one. I think I think uh, Nikki and, and John actually vlogged tearing that thing down. Did they? I think they did. We gave them a sledgehammer and said, go to town. Oh, and they had a good old time. Okay. And OCD Val was behind them with a broom and a dustpan. <laughs> yeah. Avoiding getting hit in the head with the hammer. Mm -hmm. So. <laughs> it's so jumpy. All right. Go ahead. You are all part of our neighborhood community, each and every one of you. We wouldn't be here if it weren't for you all. Do it. See, you, you screwed yourself up that time. Do it! <laughs> Do it! He just punched Do me it. in my sore arm! I did not. Come on. You are all part of our neighborhood community, each and every one of you. We would not be here if it weren't for you all. We love you. Thank you. Thumbs up. And we'll see you all tomorrow.